Today is August 28th. This is day 16. I thought it was the 27th. Yes, it was 27th. Oh. Today is the 28th. 16 is my wife, my wife Jessica. I'm just having my lunch, just going over how um, I'm throwing together this stuff. I got my asparagus, I got my salad with some feta cheese crumbles and all that good stuff in there. I ran out of cranberries, so I'm gonna have to hop on that. And my wife ate all the strawberries. So <laughs> can't throw any fruit in there. But um, I got carrots and broccoli and hummus. And these things are basically just 12 ounce salsa waters that have no calories in it to make you feel good. Um, along with the yogurt. So 16 days in, we're sticking strong. Um, halfway with my water intake, I've got a softball practice today, and I'm gonna work out after that. So maybe we'll get a little bit of me mashing some from some dingers, and uh, we'll go from there. But uh, yeah, much like I've talked about in some of the other videos, just the importance of maintaining a lifestyle, right? So if, if you do things, if you try to like crash diet or uh, I guess another way you could say this crash workout. If you, if you think like working out three hours a day for your your summer vacation trip is going to be a maintainable lifestyle, it's not. In fact, it's going to have adverse effects on the back end. Once you stop doing that, you get your metabolism up, then you, you shut off the working out, then your metabolism will drop further than where it was before. So we want to focus on maintaining healthy habits, right? Not just going on a, a quote program. Like this is something that's actually sustainable and the right wife. Hey, as, yeah. She, as she steals my hummus. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to, this is my lunch for today. It's around uh, 2.45 on the 28th. So I wanna just help you to tune in and see how we're doing and we'll get to the workout a little bit later. Yeah, he played, he had a full life scholarship to college playing baseball. And he's down with the first round back at the Angels. Wow. Like, literally out of practice. Good job. Do you want some water? I brought some water. I'm tired. There's uh, water right there. Where? Right there, the pink bottle. You earned it. Love you. So, I hope you appreciated. Uh, little snippet of my softball practice. My my wife thinks I'm a legend because in Australia uh, no one really plays baseball or softball so the fact that I can even make contact with the ball is, is mildly impressive to her and uh, I appreciate that about her. Um, just finished my workout. I'll take you downstairs. Just mixing up my protein shake. This will take us over 100 ounces. Um, so I did the exact same workout I did on the 14th, so two weeks ago, I did the exact same workout, save for um, I didn't do uh, deadlift. So last two weeks ago, I did one set of deadlift, and then I realized my hamstring was still bothering me from when I pulled it about a week before that. So I didn't do that. I didn't do it again today. Instead, I substituted uh, shrugs. I'm just going to put my workout side by side here. So the one right here will be... Uh, the 14th and the other side will be for the 28th and as you can see I mean, it's just been two weeks I haven't been working out that hard I'm not gonna lie I've been on vacation a lot of other things have come up we had weddings and I've been eating properly which is the most important thing 
but I haven't been working out a ton. I still was able to improve in every single area by a little bit. Now, granted, maybe it's because I'm pushing myself because I want to improve, you know, want to show that I, I bested the previous one. But I know last time I did the same workout, I was much more tired than I am now. So, there we go. Shakes down the hatchet. And again, it's just about making um, small gains, you know, residual improvement over time makes a huge difference. So not, you know, two weeks ago I've gotten like 10% better in every year, 10% better. I mean, that to me is a, a pretty big deal. If I could do the same thing two weeks from now, be 10% better than I am right now, and then compound that by, you know, another two weeks and another two weeks and just being marginally better, like over the course of six months, I'm gonna be twice as strong in every area I'm gonna have twice as much endurance and the results are gonna show in the way I look and feel so um, again just if you have any comments things that are on your mind any questions you have for me please feel free to ask those um, I'd love to kind of walk you through every step of the day and uh, what I'm eating when I'm getting my water um, but yeah just put your comments in the in the box below uh, please remember to like this video, to share it, and of course, please subscribe to my channel because that is how I get the exposure to help other people out and it helps me out. It helps give me the, the confidence and the motivation to keep doing this for you guys. So thanks again. I'm Eric, your recovering carb carboholic. Signing off. Peace.